A new restaurant owner has been waiting more than a year for the pandemic pause to end. Action News Now reporter Kristen Lopez takes us inside and shows us why his challenges aren't over yet. Christian Griffith had always dreamed about opening up his own restaurant, but shortly after he decided to go for it, the coronavirus pandemic hit. It was a little bit of a rough journey and it definitely took out uh, a lot of the momentum. It was a dream and then that, that dream was definitely put on pause. Griffith gave me a tour of his restaurant. It's a really cool spot. It's called Deja Vu. Inside you'll find things like personalized artwork and antiques that he's been collecting. But now that the state is opening back up and restrictions are lifting, he's facing another challenge, hiring people. So how are you handling that? Uh, well, yeah, it's, it's definitely very difficult. Um, you know, I, I initially projected I needed about 15 uh, total staff, um, and it is, uh, it, it is a trickle for sure of, of people coming in. Griffith says that so far he's only been able to make a couple of hires. Uh, I'm hoping that as things start opening up that I can kind of capture that uh, momentum of uh, some of the workforce coming back. Griffith was hoping that his restaurant would be open back in June of 2020, but because of the pandemic, that did not happen. But now he is finally ready to open and he's excited for customers to walk in through the door. I was not prepared for this whole set of challenges and hurdles that came my way. Uh, so I'm really looking forward to the, the, the normal stresses of uh, owning a business, the, the fryer breaking down. Those are all things that I feel a lot more confident about being able to handle um, because, yeah, it's been a, a wild ride to say the least. And the restaurant will be open next month. Reporting in Chico, Christian Lopez, Action News Now coverage you can count on. Griffith says he's looking to hire about 13 more employees.